Hey y'all, this is Andy. I'm down here in the shop this morning. The sun just came up. It's right at about 6 o'clock now. I've been out here since about 4.30 this morning. Still got my light going. Don't want to blind you there. But anyway, here's what I've been doing so, so far this morning. Got another little sign here made. My sister seen the one I made. She wanted one like it, so... If the dogs won't bite, I will shoot. I just got that all finished up this morning and working on another one for my buddy. Just got his name, well, his nickname burned in there, and I'm going to do a couple more other little burning things. I still got to burn in there and then stain that up and all that. <clears throat> but anyway, I got another project I'm going to be working on a little bit later today. I'm just waiting for it to get a little bit later in the morning so I don't disturb and wake up all my neighbors. Because like I said, it ain't now but 6 o'clock in the morning. So anyways, that's what I'm doing so far. I'll give you all a couple of more clips throughout the day. See y'all on the next one. Hey y'all, I'm back again. This is another clip. Um, got the sign all hung. I think I done showed y'all that one. If the dog don't bite, I will shoot for my sister. Um, here's the one I started working on this morning. Paint just now getting dry. I still got to put the hooks in it, but there you go. It's got my buddy's nickname on it. says, you know, Uncle Goob, as you can see. Then it's got a few of his little favorite things on there, like snap-on tools, Bud Light, Zippo lighters, and then course he's a Chevy guy but don't hold that against him and right there I got uh, some of that pallet wood that I cut up the other day I'm about to get started on something on something with that <coughs> excuse me so y'all see what I'm about to be doing with that once I get it all laid out and kind of halfway put together anyway I'll show you what it looks like when I get a little more done and oh by the way it's hot here in Alabama. It's only about 350,000 degrees. <laughs> All right. We'll see y'all when I get some of this put together. Thank the good Lord for power sanders. They make life so much easier. Look here. That's what it started out looking like. And this is only after about five minutes. Of sanding on these two boards both sides and all the edges and all that but I think y'all can kind of see where I'm going with this I'm gonna make a little thing looking like that I'm gonna have me a couple of boards going across the back to hold them all together and then I got me some little black hooks and I'm gonna hang kind of make it a coat hanger and Maybe stain it up. I might leave it clear like this and just seal it. and I, Or I might put a light stain on it. I ain't decided yet. But yeah, by the time I'm through sanding, these two will look like this. And I'll have it all put together and all that. So y'all see that when it's all done. But anyway, just wanted to say thank the good Lord for power tools. They make life so much easier and quicker. And yeah, it's still hot. Hey y'all, back out here in the shop. Here's what I'm doing this morning. Y'all remember the little coat hanger design thing I'm doing? I showed y'all earlier. Well, this is what I'm doing. This is the back side. I'm working on the cross members to screw them together. And I'm just pre-drilling little holes with a 3 8 inch. Sorry, the camera's shaking. With a 3 8 inch going down just a little bit just so I can countersink the screws. And I'm hoping me uh, pre-drilling these little holes will keep me from splitting the wood. So, anyway, I got this piece done, ready to drill. I'm going to go ahead and finish pre-drilling this piece and then get this screwed together. And We'll see y'all when I get it put together. Well, there's what I got so far. There's the front side of it. I'm going to do some woodworking or some wood burning designs on here. and I still got to put the little hooks on, but I'm going to do that after I get the wood burning done and the ceiling hooks will be last and hold on one second let me flip it over I'll show you what I did on the back to hold it all together and everything just give me one second y'all all right y'all this is the back side of it 
this right here is vinyl spackling. It's all gonna get sanded down once it's done drying. This is just to fill in off the screw holes. It's still wet right now. But it'll get sanded down and this very back piece right here will get painted probably just white. But if somebody wants to put it up against sheetrock or something like that, it'll make it all nice and smooth. That way it won't tear up nobody's walls or nothing. Put my little made in the USA right there. And down here, let me find it in the camera. There's my little Andy's Backyard Shop logo, 2017, because that's when I made it. And then my little signature. But anyways, I'll show y'all what it looks like. Well, I might not, because I'm thinking about making this a surprise for somebody, and I don't want to give away the surprise just in case they see my video, which I doubt anybody does so far. But anyway, I'll get there one day. But anyway, yep, there it is so far. Well... I'm about to go in the house, catch some AC while this vinyl spackling gets dry enough for me to sand it down and get a coat of paint on the back side so I can seal it all up. Anyway, I'm going to end this video here, and I'll see y'all next time. Okay, not the end quite yet. Just figured I'd give y'all one more shot of it. Maybe I can get it standing up and get a little better view for y'all. Here's what it looks like. And it'll have a little brass chain coming around the back here to you know hang it up on a wall or outside on a post or however you want to hang it but there it is anyway see y'all next time hope y'all have a great day